Hi, my name is Dr. Jimenez and I'm one of the neurosurgeons here at Riverside Medical Center. And I'd like to take the opportunity today to discuss with you a common condition that we see here in our community, lumbar spinal stenosis. This is a condition that generally affects patients older than 50 years old and it can present with a very specific signs and symptoms. Back pain as well as leg pain and difficulty uh, walking. The treatment alternatives for lumbar spinal stenosis are threefold, uh, non-surgical, open surgical, and minimally invasive surgical. The traditional uh, and non-surgical form of treatment can include physical therapy, injections, and uh, restrictions uh, in, in activities. Um, if patients fail to improve despite conservative treatment, then we recommend some type of surgical intervention. Uh, the traditional open surgery for lumbar spinal stenosis entails removing bone from the spinal canal to release the pressure on the spinal cord. Here we can see on the model that this yellow is the nerve sac and with stenosis there is pressure on the nerve sac. Other form and newer form of uh, minimally invasive treatment is the use of the X-stop device, which is a small device that gets implanted in between the vertebrae, and this allows to increase the space inside of the spinal canal. One of the advantages of this newer technique is that this particular technique can be done on an outpatient basis with a local anesthetic. The x procedure is again a minimally invasive spinal procedure and it entails uh, making a small incision in the back. The idea of the x stop is to open up the spinal canal without removing any or significant amount of, of tissue in the back. By preventing uh, scar formation, uh, this allows this procedure to be reversible. The uh, device is, as you can see here, uh, placed in between the vertebrae through a small incision in the back and that allows to increase the space inside of the spinal canal and this in turn can help decrease the leg and back symptoms associated with lumbar spinal stenosis. Um, the procedure is available to certain patients, not all patients with uh, back pain and leg pain are candidates for the x stop but it is important to have the appropriate medical evaluation as well as uh, the appropriate testing and then to obtain a consultation to determine if the x procedure is the right procedure for you.